that the fear of God would be right back in us where it belongs. The reverent respect, the worshipful fear. God is raising up, waking up the reinforcement system. Reinforcements are coming to you. Reinforcements are coming to you in the name of Jesus. I want to share, I have to write this down because I, I don't trust my memories no more. But the Lord is giving you an armor bearer with an armor bearer who has an armor bearer. Because a lot of things seem to like slip through the cracks and you can't always try to get back to things. You're going to be brought up to speed in an accelerated way. You're going to have to delegate more. You're going to have to have people that know how to catch what you're trying to give them. Because you can't, you get into a place where you're not going to be able to step aside and explain things over and over again. You ever feel like you've done said that? And you said that? And you know you said that because you were there saying that. You heard yourself say that. And you walk into a house and people are looking at you like, you ain't said nothing. Wow. Going right over their ear. But see, the time is over for that. The season for that, God has folded that up and put that away. Because he's bringing you into a place, a dimension. He said, the depth of dimension in God is waiting on you. You are too busy because of a lack of help. That's the only reason. Just a lack. But, but at the same time, you can't just grab any old person. Because a lot of them say they're with you and they're not with you. They say they're for you, but they're not for you when it comes time. Something happens when it's time. And you can't be waiting around for people. See, when God accelerates like he's doing this church, he's accelerating. He's bringing this church up to speed. Now, for some people, it's a bad acceleration because you're going to go through your stuff real quick. Real quick. You're going to feel like, man, you're going through this and, and it's going to be... Because God has to bring you up to speed in Him. Yeah. Amen. For those of us in the Lord, for those of us that are in the Lord, our acceleration is good. We start praising God even more. We're sh ha shouting hallelujahs. Our prayers are being answered. We're not having to stretch as much because we've tapped into something. Jesus. See, we're being accelerated. There's a time that's coming at the threshold of this new year. We can't wait till the new year in January to get a new word from God. We need it now. Yeah. We're in the now. now. Amen? we got to hear from God now. So he's waking up, waking up the reinforcements. Yeah. And he's lining them up and he's dusting them off. Dusting off excuses and lies of deep sleep. Jesus. Woo! Jesus. Lies of deep sleep. And he's aligning and fitting and oiling. There are many generational forms of tradition trying to find a place. But the Lord disturbs you when they try. Something inside. You know when the, when, when the things of churchianity try to get us to fit the form? Yes. And something on the inside called yes. the Holy Ghost says, I ain't going there. You on your own. Yes. Called a religious thing. Yes. And he wants to take it off of us. Traditional ways. You didn't do it like that back then. Well, you're not out there back then. Yeah. Yeah. Right. You're in the here and now and the next now and now. You're not up. God is moving. Yes. It doesn't happen until you're right at you in. You're already in and then all hell breaks loose. you got to address those things that are going through hell, and some of them are our loved ones. Address it and get right back in the presence. Don't you let that crazy devil keep you out there worrying, worrying, trying to fix them, begging them, begging them. Come on, you know you got to live right, do right, you know what you got to do. You know you know you know that you know you know. How many times do we have to be saying that? Line up, get in, get out, like do something. Yeah. If you don't get right, you're getting left. That is all right. Bottom line. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Because God's not winking at our stuff no more. Uh -huh. The secret sin ain't no secret. Yeah. Yeah. You better deal with it. 